Got a beautiful sunrise back behind me there. And there's a large skunk right above my finger there. We're out here pig hunting with a 300 blackout. I was out here yesterday and it was just pouring down rain. Dude, this skunk and I are gonna collide. It was pouring down rain yesterday. I didn't see, well, I did see one live pig. He was in a trap and I'll roll a clip of him here in a second. It was pretty interesting. Uh, didn't see any untrapped wild pigs. Uh, saw a lot of dead pigs, saw some turkeys, saw some snakes, saw a lot of wildlife. We're back today. I'm gonna check out some new areas and some areas where I did see some fresh signs. There he goes across the road. <laughs> There's tons of skunks out here. And we'll see what we can do. I think we might have some luck today. Let's get down to the river. Let's see what's up down there. Oh, and here's a clip of that uh, pig in the trap. I'm gonna turn my back towards him and he's gonna run right over here. Just like that right there. He's just a little guy, but he still got tusks and he can still do some damage and he knows it. Pretty cool. Pretty interesting, huh? They're real aggressive, even at that size. It's, it's, it's pretty cool. All right, let's get down to the river. Let's find some wild live pigs. There's another skunk. That's the fourth skunk I've seen today. That's crazy. Look at that. We're not even to the river and there's a pig. He's moving pretty quick. We're gonna intercept him here. Got him. Woo. All right, that was the right time, right place right there. We're not quite to the river. We're still moving down, but I'm sure I just scared everything within the vicinity, so that's okay. First shot was a good shot. I thought I missed, but, God, I got mosquitoes all over me. Thought I missed, but it was a good, good vital shot right here. So she wasn't going very far. She took off running. A shot I missed, but that last round connected, and I'm sure y'all heard the that noise right there. It's like a drum. That's that round that connected right there. I think she was going down anyway, though, because that right there was a good shot. Nice sow. These are the ones we want to get rid of. Not exactly a prize pig, but a pretty big one here. And check this out. You know, over at that other place I pig hunt, none of them have tusks. Over here, look at those teeth. I mean, that is, that, those are some sharp teeth. Over here they got tusks. They're built different over here. Look at all those cactus in her, man. That's crazy. All right, let's keep hunting. Let's uh, try to find another. I'm gonna have to walk two miles now. Not much going on in the riverbed. I'm not even seeing any fresh tracks in the mud. I mean, maybe. Maybe closer to the bank over there, I'll pick some up. We're gonna walk up towards the house, which is right above my thumb. We're gonna turn and we're gonna go up the creek and see what we can find up there. Porcupine, real close. Looks like he had a close call with somebody. We'll keep on moving, leave him alone.
not the most uh, eventful pig hunt in the world. We showed up, we walked like 150 yards and killed one. So that was pretty cool. And then y'all saw that one from yesterday. Uh, that was also pretty cool. Pretty cool interaction there with that male, with that boar. And we saw a porcupine up close and personal. So I guess it was pretty eventful. I brought some steel back there. I'm pretty dang tired. I'm gonna go sight in a couple guns and then I'm gonna go home and go to sleep. So I hope y'all enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you liked. Let me know what you didn't like. Dove season is right around the corner. It's still fishing season and it's hog season year round. So plenty of videos coming out. If you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. And as always, I'll catch y'all next time.